Welcome back to Song of Horror. <laughs> We're on part three. Um, last time we finished up the mansion, we found the one guy who went missing at the beginning. I lost two people. The heartbeat minigame uh, for me was a bit weird, but now I think I got a handle of it. And then on top of that, uh, Captain Hindsight here. Putting my camera down there covers the inventory, which is this, and you couldn't see it. I apologize. Wait. Yeah. Um. Last time I was trying to figure out. Let me turn my volume up on my headphones and then volume up on my keyboard. There we go. Last time I was trying to figure out where I was going. I still haven't found hmm. anything. That's the thing. Like usual, I'll go as long as possible because I want to play a lot of horror games this month, classic and new. Okay, so most of these we've already come across. And the problem is, is I don't know what to do. And well, yeah. If you wonder why it's a bit bright, I have my lamp on right now. Oh my! There we go. See? Better. More ambient. I only had it on original. Oh wait, what's this? First aid tools. Oh, okay. Alright. Hmm. Nothing Orden. Okay. If you wonder why I'm not reading the description, I think I read most of these last time. I already did that. Yeah. Device a special key. Oh. Wait, not gonna lie, I forgot I had this. Hmm. An old key found in the flower pot. I'm an idiot that I forgot I had that key. Give me a second. Hmm? Oh no, this looks like. Okay, never mind. I mean, I'd be shocked if anything was happening right now. Is there anything behind me? No. I'm running because, well, yeah. Mm -mm. Locked. If only I had the enforcer with me. I mean, let's try it. Um, inventory use. No way. Never mind how to get unstuck from the game. Nope. If you're wondering why I keep looking down, it's saying coding overloaded. Behave now, OBS. Don't know why you're overloaded right now. You're behaving just fine a few seconds ago. I forgot entirely about the key my inventory, so I'm trying to use it right now. Mm -mm. Okay. Nope. Interior flats, Isaac Fabar, Farley, Rangel, Gibbs family.
Oh, okay. Mm -mm. Okay. Real quick, I'm gonna just do something with OBS because OBS is being very mad right now. I don't know. Oh, never mind, it's long. Now it is. What's wrong with the OBS? Oh, it's... might be because of that's happening in the background. One second, I'll actually. All right, let's see if that fixes the encoding air overload. I don't. Oh, it went away. Oh. Yeah, I was doing something in the background. Hmm. I'm concerned that I haven't seen anyone yet. I mean, you should be concerned, but we should also leave. Man, look at you, are what? What's the map again? No. No, no. Ah, oh, there's the map. I'm in the courtyard. Okay. Locked, locked, locked. Got a few doors. Pretty good. Not like nope, never mind. All right. Nope. Locked. All right, so that door I can go in. That door's blocked. That's a no-go. Those three I can go in. The grill is rusty and dirty. Everything seems like it was abandoned here. Interesting. There's something in the bin. Why not? What's the worst that can happen? Oh. Culture coin. Okay. I mean, I can run back and use that before whatever the haunting is starts. I'm going to do that. Because clearly whatever the haunting is going to be here hasn't started for the character yet. So the best time to use this item is now. Also, I don't even know if this is like one of the main items in the story or what. Hey, right, buddy, how you doing? Um, I got this for you. <laughs> Message dropped down. Let's see what nonsense it says. It says. Play and win, play and lose. Having doubts go right through. Thanks. Helpful. All right, let's return. All right, see, no progress lost. I'm like, before whatever the haunting is gonna be, Let's just get whatever that is out of the way right now before I regret my life decisions. You. Alright. Mm -mm. Doors blocked, so you're a no go. Okay, that's two no go doors in the courtyard. Nothing in the trash. It's 
Sounds about right. Nope. Locked. Oh, wait, we have two locked doors, two blocked doors. All right, now we're going to check the small shack that's right here. Oh, sorry. Gardening tools will elsewhere. Nothing draws my eye and punk first glance. All right. All right. It's locked, but must have a latch. It can only be open from inside. And it looks like I'm gonna come from above. Bins are full of rubbish. You'd think the building had been completely abandoned. Ah, uh, so clumsy. God damn it. I swear if that's a very important item, man. I must get down to the cellar if I want to get my hands on that now. One second. The audio for me seemed low. No? Okay. Fine. Actually, let me look at all the settings real quick. I'm very curious. Ultra, ultra, ultra. Sure, why not? All right. Now you want to go down there to get some random key when you're only here to check for a disturbance. You haven't found a disturbance. Leave, man. Let's leave. You have a nice, happy life as a police officer. Ah, uh, well. Depends. Safe? Depends how bad the neighborhoods, I guess, you're patrolling. Mmm. Yeah. Mm -mm. Got two other doors. Mm -mm. Door is blocked, so that door is just dead. Not happening. Now, how about this? The door is jammed, the locks are all rusted up. It's that here unused for a few months, no doubt. Alright, so every single door there. Anyway, I'm making a face because it's reversed. That's annoying. Alright, so that door doesn't exist. That door doesn't exist. This and that door don't exist. This door down there doesn't exist. Okay. Well, that means we only have one place to go. A place where all the spooky noises. I don't think it'll work. These old buildings, it would be so easy for someone to open the door and fall down the shaft. Alright, looks like restricted access has a door I can open that will lead me back to the one area. End of shift report, date 11, August 1998. Shift night, time submitted 7 a.m. Agent Sullivan Walter, code 09534. Incidents, 10.38 p.m. While on the rounds, I detected a small leak uh, in one of the water pipes. I placed a bucket underneath, under it, and sent a nose to the building's insurers. 1.13 a.m. I hear someone pounding on the main door coming from outside. I approach and ask who is there with no response. The pounding stops. When I open it, I see no one on the streets. 4.40 a.m. I think I hear a melody playing behind me. I go out into the inner courtyard and find Mr. Isaac Fabar fair, barefoot and wearing nothing but a pair of blue pajamas. His eyes are closed and in his hand he's holding a small uh, holding a music box which is which plays as he walks slowly. He ignores me when I call to him and enters the door leading to into his shop. Not like the doorman's office is locked and there's no one getting in there. 
I mean, no one's in there anyways. All right, so I need a key to get in there. The problem is I'm afraid to go over here. Let's do it. Grab a plant. It's nothing too unusual. All right, we're looking for a bar. Let's take it nice and slow. F, 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 F. No. Ah. There. Oh, they really give you full movement, don't they? Man, I'm a... Oof. The door is closed with an anti-theft mechanism and is nice and thick. The neighborhood is quiet, but I'd better, be, I better stay safe. Alright. Wait. Let's use to look at those. I can't hear. I said keys in plain view of everyone just. So. I have a coat hanger. Nope. I'm not skilled enough to hook the keys even when I hang. Oh, okay. Alright, so what do we have? This door cannot open. All that is locked. I don't have any keys on me. I got a gun, spray bottle. I can't enter here. You need a key. Someone's watching on the cameras. Alright, so we got through all that. I have as much as I started with. Nothing. Um, I don't know what I can use the bottle with. Can I combine that with that? Yeah, no. This is something else. That I am not using at all. Thing is, there's nothing else left for me. The only thing I think of is there's something I'm missing there, but then. I think I need the keys to even open the mailboxes. So I don't know. Mmm, love apple cider. Um, I don't know. You're probably screaming at me. You have to do this thing at that one place, but I don't know. In crash can? No. I already looked in there. You need a it opens from the inside, which I think I have to go through that window up there. So I'm going to the second floor at some point. 
restricted access i need a key and then i need something to grab the other key i don't know but i think the coat hanger is going to get used in some way i'm going to go back in here I'm still walking, even though I've just been in here. I just don't trust it that much. Also, his heartbeat is going right now. Okay. Alright. Oh, that was him moving into place. I got very nervous and I kept hearing movement. One of these has to be open. Nothing. Yeah, right there, for bar. But we can't open it. Which makes me think they're here for show? Or for a whole other reason. Then there's another for bar here. For the Ida. Uh, Anna. Rachel. Adrian, Herb, Russell, Norman, Sebastian, Mail, Wilford, Malcolm, Devin, Ulysses, Joseph, Harris, Cassidy. No, no, no. <sighs> Chloe, Lang I'm gonna take guess and say these are names of the developers. Maybe there's something I'm missing. Examine. Um. Hmm. It's empty. It's very light. Okay, that didn't help. Uh, examine. Is there anything in you? No. Hmm. Darn. I am missing something. A very key item something. No, I already talked about that. Someone can open it and fall down the shaft very easily. Got a feeling that's a way you can die. Hmm. <laughs> it didn't get me, I swear. It didn't get me. Alright, give me a second. I need to actually take a leak. Alright, I'm back. And I am doing fine. Don't worry. But yeah, back there, there's nothing. I guess I have to go back. Maybe I missed something. I honestly have no idea.
The camera angle seems a little different, or is it just me? No, it's just me, okay. Alright, so those three doors are locked. There's nothing I can do here. Uh, go back to the main room. Look around. Oh. Okay, so you might not see where I'm pointing, so I'm going to try and do my best. The bottom right. The stairwell leads down. Except that door was locked. Once again, I need a key. Have I already been in the bathrooms? Yes. Okay. Water closet, we're going to call it. Uh, I don't know. What was that? Reinforced door like this, I will never be able to hear a ding. I don't want to go in there. say don't go in there I have no idea what that was but it fled the scene who wants to take about it and flee the scene it's still in there any takers hmm how many bets I'm gonna open that door and die. Nope. Oh, I still can't open the door. I guess a man leave now. Still got your life. Nothing abnormal. Damn it, I still need whatever the switch is. I got nothing. But yeah. Would it be here? Because there is a great above oh whoops sorry i let go up and i'm going down gotta hold up well that's a big insect right next to me hmm i'm gonna take care of that i wish i was joking you'll have to forgive me there was actually a giant uh centipede looking thing crawling up my wall i was like what's catching my eye over there i'm not that paranoid yet nothing's really happened but yeah, crawling on the wall. I'm like, I'm gonna take care of that. I don't, not a bug fan. Especially that. It was big. Just flush down the toilet. That's what I do. Like, I'm gonna sit beside her. But yeah, that's why I was looking like, what is that? Back to getting this card or whatever bell. I can't hear it. Now, I forgot to click back on the game. I've got you. I've got you. What the? Stop. Paluka Lake. Hmm. These little decorative, decorative decorations always end up in storage room. Good. Oh wait, the magnet. It's stronger than I thought.
All right, so there's something crawling around. It's not the darkness. This is like something else. The darkness was like a cloud that would kill you of bodies. This is like a actual body. What can I do with a magnet? I can get that key maybe. Then the problem is I combine that with something. You? You knew? That honestly makes sense. Warco hanger bet. Yeah, okay. Good. All right. So I was thinking to myself, it being by itself is not going to make any sense. I won't be able to reach anything with it. The coat hanger is useless. Wrap the coat hanger around the magnet. You're good to go. Take one of those swords, even though I have a gun. So now I can grab that key that I've been trying to get. And I can make progress. Remember, it crawled over that grate. So whatever it was, it crawled over it. It's probably going to... If I had to take a guess, it's going to show up once I grab that key. Once I grab that key... What? Um... <gasps> okay, it's blind. The silence. It can't see you, but it can sure hear you. Running is futile, but you need to keep calm and stay quiet in order to do so. You need to control your breathing by gently moving left trigger and right trigger. Try to keep the white circle as close to the frame as possible. If it feels your presence, it will come closer and closer with each mistake you make. Don't let it reach you. <sighs> Right, guys, I hate to say it, I think I'm dead. dead oh tutorial you can't die okay um was that a person what else could it be i must be imagining tens um Keep with the circle. Okay. Keep it keep as close to the frame as possible. I think I was doing okay at it in some areas, but it's unsure what I'm doing. Also, I would 100 percent died if it wasn't tutorial. Alright. Wait, what's the abyss? Oh, great. I mean, we're going to figure those out probably later. All right. Um, I hate to say, if that happens again, I might die. I might die. I also got the munchies right now. And by that, I mean, I just feel like having a snack. 
All right, use the coat hanger magnet. We got the doorman's key. Woo! Okay, this is actually very satisfying right now. Now, I've opened several doors. I got a feeling this is one of them. Wait. the key to the switch you'll find in the shop counter in case anyone needs access to the exposition gallery there are security cameras oh we got an end of shift report end of shift report date 22nd of august 1998 shift daytime time submitted 7 p.m agent rid Ritveld Simon, code 55173. Incidents, 8.51 a.m. The plumber from the insurance from the insurance arrives and repairs the leak in the pipe. I sign the insurance claim form. 10.22 a.m. A package is delivered to block 2, flat 3B. Nobody's home is stored at the doorman's desk temporarily. 12.06 p.m. Mr. Isaac Vibar is asked about the incident which took place during the night shift. He seems to be confused and not know what I am talking about, and appear, appearing upset. He asks me many questions. I offer to call a doctor, but he assures me he is fine. 317, a door-to-door -door salesman is found trying to sneak into the inner courtyard. I usher him out of the building. The only monitor now is displaying nothing. Better to go around you do a go around on the building. Okay. Ooh, totally inappropriate for a workspace. Nothing I wasn't expecting, though. Ooh la la. Okay, give me a second. Let me figure out where I'm going. Okay, we're going straight. All right. Oh, wait, we can unlock that door, but give me a second. Notes prepared with errands and, com and a complaint by Erica Fabar to the building's doorman. Apparently, this Walter is a bit of a shady character. Mm -hmm. All right, there's my shortcut. First things first. Sounds trustworthy. Once again, we're in a room. That's an important item, I immediately see. Right. A crank handle. That opens the door. Hmm. It seems to operate some kind of electrical device. Maybe it's even a lock. Yes, you are right. Hmm. Crime. I saw five minutes of it once. I almost shot a hole in the telly. The ways it portrays Police work is almost unfortunate. Let's do this. Whatever I do, don't look in a mirror. A bra. I've seen situations like this before, and they're usually due to burglaries or invasions of privacy. I see something on that cleaning cart. Hydrogen peroxide, USP first aid antiseptic. Hmm. Hydrogen peroxide, the forensic team use it to activate luminal and criminals to erase traces of organic matter. Not very typical of buildings overseer to have facilities in such a state, even if it's just for personal use. Okay. All right, so we got something. We got hydrogen peroxide. 
All right, so I'm going to leave out of that room, go through that room, and explore that room, because I have the crank. As long as nothing bad happens. I can't hear anything. I would have left a hundred percent by now. But this guy is dedicated to the job. I keep hitting the wrong button. Doors unlocked. Let's look at the monitor and make sure there's nothing waiting for me. Let's check. I honestly... Okay. I'm gonna open that door and if I immediately die... Remember, the door's too thick to listen through, so I gotta just go. There's a firearm there. I hope it's just decorative. Or that the glass is truly secure. Hmm? Display case is reinforced. I imagine its contents are quite pricey. The display case is in perfect shape. The contents look expensive, but nothing... Okay. Behind the reinforced glass, I see gold and silver coins. I assume they're ancient. Hmm. The door, glass, commission locks. Play... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. That's important. A display case full of masks and other antiques. Other than that... Okay, no interest. Oh, wait. All right, uh, bear with me. I got an idea. How many numbers is it? Damn, it's five. Okay, I was thinking of the agent codes. Code 55173. What's the other code? Damn. Oh, I was hoping that was it. All right, let's see what I can find. No. Ancient jewels. I mean, there's more doors I can unlock. So that's something. I'm afraid to go grab my drink and take a sip out of it. Because I got a feeling this game's going to be a big jerk enough about it. That's going to have me get attacked. Well, Both doors are locked. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's on the other side. Filing cabinets filled documentation carrying on the investigation would be an utter nightmare. There's something quite larger under the blanket. I have a bad feeling about this, but maybe I should take another look. No! 
No, not until I'm desperate for progress. I'm not doing that. Last time I did that, my guy died from falling off a roof. Okay. I forgot to unlock the mm -hmm. door. Right. Yeah, last time I did something that's like, are you sure you won't do that? My guy died. Isaac, I'm afraid it's too late. I have heard the melody. Catherine and the children have two, just once. Nothing will happen to them, will it? Dear God, that melody. Something is different inside my head. It's making me see things I don't understand. Things I... I would rather not continue seeing. I'm sorry, Isaac, but I feel forced to send the music box back to you. I will keep researching it, but I don't want to have it anywhere near me. I must think of my family. Please take care of yourself. Forgive my lack of courage. Sebastian P. Husher. There's other people in the house, and I'm trying not to scream, which is why I immediately just went, Yep, shut up, me. Paintings, they're valuable, but I don't like them at all. But I told you I am a wimp at video uh, horror games, I meant it. I am the biggest wimp. Good. Why do you think I keep averting my eyes? Oh, we got a cassette and a stairwell. Do I want to go there? There's two other doors I can open. Um, I'm going to go back, go out to the courtyard before I go up the stairs, because the stairs are going to lead to even bigger places for me. I'm going to grab my drink. I'm immediately pausing it. Pause. I don't trust the game anymore. Right now, death is on the prowl. Death has a face, and I absolutely hate it. Also, it's kind of ugly. Before I use the key. Alright, so here's the thing so far. We have that weird thing crawling around. Have yet to come across the darkness yet. I'm not gonna let my guard down though. I know for a fact bad things can happen real quick. Another stairwell. Notices for local residents, some from months ago. Doesn't anyone take care of the building? Probably not. They're all dead and gone. All right, we're opening the other door. Listen, I'm trying to do this entire floor before I even go. Um. Yeah, I don't think we need to talk about it. No way. Oh, really? Yeah, um... Can't wait to go upstairs. I'm gonna go up the other one first. <laughs> By the way, like I said, if the silence thing happens again, expect me to die once. I'll have to take over a new character because I don't think it's gonna go well for me. Especially because 
the mini game's weird. All the mini games are weird. All right, so this one leads to the interior flats. That leads to block two. We got progress on both ends. First things first, though. Got cassette. Right. All right. Uh, recording of Isaac Favar. A voice recording of the antique dealer. Okay. Let's listen. I had another nightmare last night. I was lying in bed and I felt something staring at me from the corner of the bedroom. I knew that there was something there, something very real, but I didn't dare turn on the light because I didn't want to see whatever it was. I was afraid, afraid of going mad if I did. So, perhaps in a rush of panic, courage or folly, I turned on the light and woke up. I got out of bed and went to the bathroom to wash my face, attempting to lift away the heavy feeling of something pressing on my chest. Then I saw my reflection in the mirror. The face looking back at me was grotesque. It was deformed and changed color, and it was jolting about with despair. It was banging against the glass time and again, trying to warn me or to escape the place it was in. It seemed as if it was screaming, but I couldn't hear anything. The scene was so horrific that, well, I woke up again. I was inside the bathroom, standing before the shattered mirror. Interesting. Noses, warnings, complaints. Okay. The lights are flickering. I don't like that. So far, it sounds quiet. Oh man, been almost going for an hour. Doesn't feel like it. I only screamed once. And I muffled it. No way. Okay, that door doesn't exist. Understood. It's a Resident Evil. It's a, not a Resident Evil. A Silent Hill door where this lock is broken. We all know Silent Hill. This lock is broken. Oh, that door doesn't exist. Then. Thank you, game. Alright, I don't hear anything. Nope. Okay, once again, door is blocked. We got a note on flat A. Alright. Father, I kept a copy of the key to the house and display case in the showroom inside the Chinese puzzle. I would have left it in the store for you, but I don't trust the doorman. I have provided you with a reminder of the combination on the back of this note in a somewhat cryptic form. Though, just in case it falls in the wrong falls into indiscreet hands. A big hug, Erica. Walter, if you're reading this, take a hike. So the showroom has what I need. To get into their apartment. Okay. Please don't do the silence on me here. I will die. I don't want to lose this guy. I like him. Right, on the bottom floor. Good. That gives me a chance to go through the door, up the stairs, to block two. Because I still don't have anything that can really progress my... Can I combine those? Probably. I still don't... I'm not going to combine them yet because I still have yet to find use for this. So those are going to remain the way they are at the moment if you can combine them. Um, I still wonder what the service weapon can be used for. I have no idea. Alright, let's go to block two. I feel that's going to be a joy. Yeah, if the silent... I'm sorry, I feel very... Just... You hold left 2 and R2, you let go, bring it back, try to keep it... Keep the white circle as close to the frame as possible.
Alright, you move it in a breathing motion. Okay. I'm not making any promises I'll live past the next one. I hate to say. Alright, so this one has four doors on the bottom and then a stairwell. This side reminds me a lot of Silent Hill. Alright, and one door is immediately unattainable because I am afraid to move a bike. Mm -mm. Nope. Oh. Okay. Mm -mm. Okay, how about this key? Mm -mm. Okay, making sure, making sure. How about this one? Nope. How about, okay. Mm -mm. All, right, all these are different keys. Let's go. The courtyard mm. is quiet. I'm trying to lighten up the mood because I'm actually very scared. Nope. Alright, how about this? No. Listen, you might think it's just try a key. I'm trying to key in every single one, okay? There might be a chance. If there's a mm -mm. chance, well, okay. Mm -mm. Nope. 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 Mm -mm. It's amazing how many doors there are that I can go in. I should be coming across a hanged person soon. Ooh, that camera transition was beautiful. Ooh, A's upside down. Does that mean anything? I don't know. Not like. Right, I'm just gonna try. We're doing this mm -mm. for every single one. I'm sorry, but there's a chance this key opens nope. something. I am mm -mm. trying it, okay? No way. Mm -mm. Alright. Nope. Nope. No way. All right. Once again, we have more. Hey, he thinks it's the banks of the rain, dude. You just saw horrors that you couldn't even add up, and you think it's abandoned because of the rain. Even I know that is not the case. Just making sure. Mm -mm. Nope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. All right. Nope. I'm trying all these. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No way. All right. All right. So all this was for nothing. Wow, really? Block two is completely off limits right now. Okay. Not gonna lie, that cloth is looking very... Wait. Can I open that shack? No, it opens from the inside. And that one opens with different keys. So yeah, it looks like I might have to take the cloth off. Maybe. I'm not gonna... I know the item I need now is in the exhibit room. The problem is the exhibit room, the case is locked. Can I keep moving? Yes, I know I can run. No, I don't trust the game that I can run without any consequences. Listen, I have played some horror games in my life, and I know running makes sound, and running attracts. 
I played two hours of Alien Isolation. I know. Now, if you're wondering why, why do you play two hours only of Alien Isolation, you wimp? It has nothing to do with me being a wimp. My friend dared me to play the game in the hardest difficulty. You might be shocked. That game is hard on the hardest difficulty to the point I could not beat it. And I kept dying at the alien over and over and over again in a sequence. And it took me an hour to get away from, like, the people. Uh, where the lady's shooting the gun, saying, guys, over here, we have a survivor. You go, you get the jack, then you come in. On the hardest difficulty, my god, they track you. Then after that, the alien chases you in that medical bay. It's hard on the hardest difficulty. Would not recommend. Amazing game, though. I would play it this year, but I already have multiple horror games in my head that I want to play. And that game is a long one, and I know it's a long one, so, um... Hate to say Alien Isolation, not this year. I do want to play it, though. Okay, so if I go back through there, there, and there, get to the main room, go there, okay. I have a plan in mind. Is it a good plan? I have no idea. We're about to find out. Because right now, everything I do can lead me to die. Which sucks. Because I like this guy. Real quick, what do we have? We have Dorman's Keys and Hydrogen. Settle down. Hey, look, it's Pinocchio. I think I said it last time. Okay. What item do I need? Let's go here. No. I meant to. I meant to listen. I mean, I'm alive. So, it doesn't matter, but still, I meant to listen. As soon as he gave me the prompt, I just hit it. Something tells me I'm in danger. I have no idea what's happening right now. What is hunting me? Ooh, a wrench. Frankly, quite strange. Should I include it in the report? Am I good? Somebody threw something away in the waste paper basket. Where? I'm too busy running away from my life. End of shift report. Damn, Walter, what the hell have you done? I found traces of mud on the stairs to block four, which led down the window on the first floor. I know it was you. Plus, you ruined the handle on the window. Have you gone mad? I informed the building handyman so he can fix it as soon as possible. I don't know what the hell's up with the gir that girl. I don't give a damn. Stop screwing around. Start behaving yourself. 
It may turn out she's not hysterical, as you claim, but rather that you're being one big weirdo. This last time I'm putting up with you. I don't like the noises. Got an adjustable wrench. I might be able to use that on that cabinet in the main room. I have no idea what's going on right now. Something is trying to hunt me. Yeah, things just got very serious very quickly. Um, give me a second. <sighs> Hate to say it, I'm not going that way. Uh, if you notice, there have been no hiding places. Except there, in the main room. Oh, wonderful. <gasps> hey everyone, I'm gonna die. Get ready. Game's too weird. That one I don't get. Just like the last one. I don't get that one. I really don't. I'm trying. Remember, keep breathing icons as close to the moving frame as possible. Well, uh, that was short lived. Um. Damn it. Lost him. Alright, Daniel, you're the main character. So I'm not gonna play you because you will die. I'll play Erica. Do not carry. Uh, no, don't. You don't need to carry that. My, let's do it. I knew I was gonna die. I knew it. That silent mini game. The mini games in this game are weird. I mean, probably when you know them, you got them under control, but when you are first learning about them... What was that? <laughs> Alright, let's see if we find your grandfather. Maybe after this I'll make something to eat real quick. I am feeling a little hungry. Ooh, lighter. Okay. So let's see what we got. We got a cassette player, which we're not going to use. All my notes. Okay, let's go. The one thing I really do like is each character has different thoughts on different things in the game going on. Man, it's a good thing I know where I died, everybody. <laughs> Whose bag is this? Definitely not police officers, don't worry. I knew it. I knew something was gonna happen too. All right, wrench. Why would Dad put his house keys in here? Isn't it a bit too much? He a dance place, as old as his tastes. Oh wait, you can regrab that. Okay. Oh, I got the key. Um, that door's locked. That door doesn't exist. I can't do anything with you. I don't have anything to get that with. I can go to block two or to the courtyard. 
the courtyard, that one locked door might be... Yeah, let's try. Hey, um, a police officer died here, so, uh, you know, try and keep it together. With this, I want to go down. Now, at least she will be familiar with this place, in a way. Alright, and just like that. Maybe progress? Let's go. Yeah, that breathing minigame is gonna get me killed. Now, the thing is, is if I lose all my characters and have to redo the chapter, I will. I'm gonna have to practice that breathing minigame more. It's weird. Like, I finally got the controls of the, uh... One when you're hiding, control your heartbeat. Give me a second. Okay. Let's see if this is it. How about... Oh no, the, the, that key is gone. Alright, so... Okay. I guess we'll go that way. Uh oh, that's... We're going up. Okay. Yeah, we're going... Hey, the dead body's gone. I just know, style the window. The bodies. I'm hearing things. It's probably the pipes. Alright. Okay, Missy. Um, we're climbing all the stairs. You're probably gonna die also. I'm not gonna play Daniel because he seems like he's the main character and I hate for him to die. I killed his boss, though. By accident. Let me open one of these. Awesome. Okay, back to Song of Horror. Let's have a horrible time. Well, maybe you're having a good time. I'm not. I forgot to turn that lamp off. I'm glad I did. <laughs> All right. I hear movement. Yeah, if it does that breathing mini game again, I. I don't know. Hold left and right trigger and try and keep it. All right. So you want to keep the white circles close to the frame as possible. So while it's moving, you want to move. Wait, no, it just hit me. His room is on the interior flats. I just wasted time. This gives it time to haunt me. If you're wondering why I don't look out the window anymore, it's because if something pops out, it'll be out those windows and be like, hi, it's me. I'm going to kill you. It's like, nah, I'm not going to look out the window and give it the uh, satisfaction of scaring me. Why didn't I just play Resident Evil 2? Oh, right. That's the game I played before this. To get a little buffer for October. A little buffer, just a little one. I like the little buffer. I've been playing for an hour. Right, let's do this. All right. I went in the wrong room. I want to go there. Okay, yeah, let's go. I am completely fine. This place isn't clearly haunted. I'm here to find my grandfather, uncle, whatever. I 
I'm gonna laugh if the silence is here and her character just ends. Honestly, the silence is less creepy than the hiding minigame of the heartbeat, which I like personally. Uh, shame the minigame is a little jank for me. All right, here we go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Prog progress. Those doors are not real. Give me a second. Is that the Blair Witch thing? Christ, something's wrong. Dad, where in the world have oh, you gone? Oh, Dad, my bad. Dad never leaves the house so late, especially in this weather and without a scarf. Daddy, where are you? My dad's keys. Can't have left the house unless it was an emergency. The mirror is shattered. Did dad do this? But why? It doesn't make sense. I thought it was her uncle or grandfather. Whoops, it's dad. Right, let's go to this one first. Let's see if we can find your dad. All right, bigger than I thought. Other way, I was trying to find the way that is the dead end. And from the map, I thought that room was. Nope, 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 nope. This might be the study. Can't go in there. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, an ultraviolet lamp to examine to examine that painting if you even call it that, but why? What is this painting doing here under the lamp? Where did it come from? Why is this so important? Um, why would I do that? I don't know. Oh. Huh. Sweet, I got the bulb. Hmm. An old piano, Husher brought, bought it for us and immediately gave it to my dad as a thank for helping him for his first book. A bunch of strangers' diaries. Is dad doing some kind of research? I miss you so much, mummy. You know I dropped everything to help dad when you left us. If we survived your loss. I know we can survive anything. The cups have gathered some dust. I can't believe it. Dad's constantly cleaning. Alright. Dear Isaac, I hope you're feeling better or at least a bit more calm. I know who made the box, but he died years ago. His name was Argos Legrant. As soon as I find out more, I'll let you know. I believe the key lies in returning the box. If you have the list from the auction at which you purchased it, you can surely locate the former owner. I think things have improved since I sent back to you. Yes, I'm positive. I hope everything is going well, Sebastian P. Husher. Why does Dad keep a month-old newspaper? Did you find anything interesting in it? Well, I can tell you this. Things did not improve. Um, he's gone. Wife and kids are missing. Hmm? The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Fall from, yeah. 
Okay. The dishes are clean, but covered in dust. Coffee and tea for an entire nation. Dad. The doctor you lay off the stimulants. What the hell? But dad doesn't smoke. What? with the half-smoked bags. Oh, we got a tape. Oh, wait, that's not a tape. Those are cockroaches. Pet food, a box full of dead cockroaches. I never wanted to run away from this place this badly, but I have to find Dad. Yes. Dear daughter, I've tried to arrange the keys for you. The old ones to the right hand column are old keys. I keep them just in case. The colored metal keys are for security door to the shop and locks. The square gold keys are the black plastic keys are for devices and apparatuses in the shop. The round and triangular silver keys are the copies you made for the old display cases. The round green plastic keys are for your motorcycle and red plastic key for the save. The small, oh Jesus. There's a lot of keys. The small gold keys for the little box with your mother's things. The other three things in storage rooms. Okay, dad. Thanks for nothing, daddy. What the hell is in the fridge? It stinks big time. You know what, let's not open it. That simple. Just don't open the fridge. Don't look at the fridge. I'm afraid the TV's gonna jump scare or do something. So, Sebastian P. Husher found who owned the box. That's useful. Okay. Oh, no, nope, nope, nope. At least I know to play that minigame. Book of Magic Rituals? Exorcisms? Black Arts? I don't get it. The voice? Okay, let's do it. Erica. I hope you are the one to find this, my daughter. I have had a few problems. Some sort of nightmares or visions. I don't know what to call them. I'm exhausted. I have a hard time falling asleep. And the doctor believes it's stress. But I suspect it's something else altogether. That blasted box. Sebastian. You've got to find Husher, Sebastian Husher, the professor. My friend, or so he said. Find him and ask him how he did away with this. Ask him whether he also saw things. Ask him why he's abandoned me like this. Ask the black figure. Those who crawl do not want to see it. They crawl. The noise they make. No, don't ask. Don't get near. I can't sleep because of that noise. Because they drag me away too. They are taking me. The black figure. I don't want to see it either. The figure. Please. Whatever you do. Don't listen to the box. He set the bat fire. Is this some kind of sick joke? A Bible next to the bottle of whiskey. Dad hardly drinks, and he's certainly not religious. What the hell is he looking for? He's following. He's so desperate. He's looking at the things he never believed in before religion. Circle piece, a wooden circle piece carved decoration. What was this? I feel like it's on tip of my tongue. I just can't remember. I don't. Dad and Husher shared their taste for art and design. The painting is their home, says it all. Books on theology, particularly the history of mythology of religion of religions. 
Tranquilizers. These aren't the meds Dad usually takes. What bombless pit have you fallen into, Daddy? I really don't want to look at the Ouija board, but we'll look at it. This is just pure desperation. A Ouija board? Yeah. There's a hiding place here. Meaning, I got a feeling we get hunted by the darkness finally. I just have a feeling it's going to happen. On top of that, his place, I believe, is... Patient zero. Yeah, we're good. Oh, hello. Oh, one of the magazine, magazine, magnesium flash cameras. Dangerous little things. I swear if it does a flash jump scare again. Oh, oh, I see it. Bottom left, look in the doorway. There's an eyeball on the top left, bottom right. I'm not seeing anything at the moment. And top right, also not seeing anything. What does little experience? I, don't, I hope he knows what he's doing. Oh. There's a shadow, but there's no one there. And then for the top one, you see something climbing out of the ceiling in a way. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. These... Oh, sorry, these. This is where the developed pictures we were... We would take for antique cameras. I still have a lot to learn. Yeah, okay, so... That proves... The horror he is seeing is actually... In... The physical world. It's not in his head. Which doesn't help. It really doesn't help. At all. Okay, so there's something I need to do in the dark room. There's a hiding place in the bedroom. Okay. I'm not looking at the mirror. The mirror just always ends badly. It's covered in dust. I don't get what's going getting in you, Dad. Not gonna look at the mirror. The mirror always ends badly. Yeah, the mirror just makes them more stressed than they need to be, is what I've noticed. It's like, ah, look at this mirror. So I'm not going to. All right, real quick. Let's just check both. Both are safe. Let's go in this one first. Family pictures from ages ago. Shit, mom. She were here. That has never been the same. Okay, well, this room was... something. The other one. I have a feeling the next big item like Okay, okay, I'm about to tell you right now. Okay, sorry, controller's plugged in. Okay, when it's telling you left and right trigger, one trigger does half a circle. Always keep one trigger pushed, I've just learned. One trigger's half a circle, both triggers are full circle. When it goes minimal, let go both triggers, half a circle, one trigger, full circle, both triggers. Explain that next time. 
I lost a police officer because of you. I am... Damn. Thank God it couldn't hear me. I am very happy with that, actually. I am very happy with that. Okay, so I have the heartbeat minigame down and the silence now down. The silence is just keep adjusting to what you're hearing. Keep one finger on a trigger all times unless it's going all the way down, then let go. Okay. Okay. Dad, are you in there? Definitely not. Sorry, ma'am. She's not, he is not. All right. Okay. Okay. We got the silence. We got black light. Uh, man, we have a lot of things. Right, you know, I'm finally. Oh, not with that. No, 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 no. Sorry, I'm, I'm pressing my button. Combine this with this. Nope. Okay. So no, that's it. not it. Okay. What am I gonna use a UV bulb for? And I forget. What is the circle piece for? Hmm? What was it feel like? Is this? Alright, let's go back. I think I'm done here. The black room is the only thing left that has something to do with it, but I can't do anything. Huh? Just gonna leave the room immediately. I think I'm mixing something, but it looks like some ingredients are missing. I have luminol. Oh, hydrogen peroxide. Yeah, no, the police officer was saying something about luminol. Let me see. Oh. Yeah, the police officer said something like, this is used for luminol, so. Oh. Oh, wait. It splashes. All right. All right, real quick. Where am I going when I leave this room? I got nothing new. Other than a disc. I don't know what the disc is for. Maybe exposition hall? Ah, oh, the nooses aren't leaving. That's nice. Pause, 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 pause. I don't trust the game. I really don't. I just want to check my phone real quick. And it's getting that light already. What? I had an item delivered today from Amazon. One second. I actually have to pause recording. I didn't know. Sorry about that. I had a package delivered that wasn't supposed to be due till tomorrow. Except for the hedgehog, and well, right now I'm gonna tell you it's nine o'clock. Uh, more accurately, is nine going on ten? Literally, it's nine fifty-seven. Package was delivered at six fifty. I am shocked no one took that off my doorstep. And again, if someone took it, they'll be like, "Oh, it's hedgehog feed." Oh, I don't want that. Like I said, I wasn't expecting that until tomorrow. I'm so glad I checked my phone. <laughs> okay, back to this. Yeah, hedgehog feed. I'm like, I know it's due tomorrow. Apparently it was due today. Okay, we want to go there. In there, just go straight, straight ahead, straight ahead. Okay, we're in the big main room, the room of stuff. The one that killed the police officer, remind you. 
check the camera before I even attempt to go in there. Actually, can I use the token this on you? Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Make sure. I definitely wasn't eating a cookie as I resumed the recording. Don't worry. Definitely didn't do that. If I crawl underneath this table, put a straight face. Oh. Okay. Place. Do I have to go to the exhibit room? If so, let me look at the camera. I got a disc. I don't know what to use it for. Alright. Is it safe? Looking pretty be safe. Okay. The room is empty. I don't know what else I was expecting. Trust me, you know what you're expecting. Right. I want to go over here. Oh, I need a code for that. Mm. I haven't found that either. Wrinkled piece of paper. Is there a code on this? No. Walter, damn you. No, no. Instruction on keys. No, wait, is there anything on the back? No. Damn it, wait. Beep, man. Yeah. Um, this isn't useful. This isn't useful. Oh no. Oh no. I'm mad at dead end. That wrong. Okay. Well, it looks like. I am stuck at the moment, and I'm going to have to think this through. There's things I can do. I got black light, a black UV ball, I should say. I got hydrogen peroxide. I have a couple things, but I won't be able to really...